Hello, sweet friends. My name is Angie, and welcome to the Bumblebee Farmhouse, a place where I hope that you can find a little bit of inspiration to make your house a home sweet home. Today's video, we are going to give some attention to our autumn kitchen, and we will be decorating our hutch for the autumn season. So if you have a little bit of time, I'd love for you to come on over and stay a while here at the Bumblebee Farmhouse, where you are always welcome. Now let's get to decorating. Come and don't run away with me You can see what there is to see And you look like a crazy dream See you running through an open door I don't wanna be alone no more And you look like a crazy dream You are going to notice so many copper elements in my kitchen, um, specifically the hutch today. I have fallen in love with coppers, blues and whites, and I am trying to fit it in into our kitchen all year round if I can, but I found some beautiful pieces at antique shops and I want to incorporate them all into the hutch. I'm going to mix them with some blue and white pieces, some of my favorite cookbooks, some um, beautiful uh, Ray Dunn pieces that I have. I'm just going to see how it goes and put some pumpkins in there um, and try to tie it all in together. Now this beautiful artwork I picked up at Target. They brought it out a few years ago and they finally brought it back in about a few months. I don't know if it's in stock anymore, but I couldn't believe it. So I grabbed it when I could and I had it shipped to my house. But I love this. This is not just for autumn. This is for all year round. I love the moodiness of it, but it fits in so well in my little cottage and farmhouse kitchen. I love the colors. The frame, it's just very beautiful and I'm so glad that I have it. Now, I picked these beauties up at a really wonderful shop up in Beloit, Wisconsin. It's called Vintage Bliss. I'm pretty sure somebody crafted these, but how perfect for my kitchen. Love the blue and white. Um, so I thought it would be perfect with the gold and kind of orangey pear artwork. I just think that these colors complement each other so well. Um, so I thought so pretty so I'm gonna put one I have two of them I'm gonna put one on each side of the artwork to give it a little bit more of an autumn flair Walking down the boulevard the sound of summer echoes in these streets we And just to tie it in with all the metallics, I picked these up at Dollar Tree a few years ago. I don't know if they still sell them. I have not seen them. But they're like these coppery, bronzy pumpkins. I love these. So I thought I would tie it in and put one right in the middle of the really beautiful artwork. Now, I love a good cookbook, so I thought I had to display some of my favorites, and most of them here in my collection are Ina Garten's Barefoot Contessa, but I think adding some cookbooks in the kitchen just kind of cozies up even more, like my little cookbook nook. So just to kind of go along with the theme, I'm adding a blue and white chinoiserie jar. My mom got me this for my birthday a few years back and it's just going to give some of that blue and white depth to everything else I'm going to add in here. I picked these up at Michael's a few years back and they're these really pretty metallic coppery um, plates, pumpkin plates. and. I thought these would be so perfect to have them stacked up. Obviously, you can use them, but I just thought they would be so wonderful to have them stacked up. 
um, just to give some dimension and depth and also you know it's useful it's in the kitchen they are plates so I thought this would go along perfectly and then to add a little bit of autumnal contrast I have this pumpkin it's like a ceramic pumpkin it's white and gold I picked this up from Target a few years back um, so I thought I would stack it on top of the pumpkin plates just to give it some more depth and just some color contrast an added bonus is it's also a jar so I can store whatever I need in there and on each side of that I'm going to add a little bit of copper starting with this copper little pumpkin I had some extras of these and then from Target Hearth and Hand Magnolia, I have these really beautiful copper salt and pepper mills. So I'm putting these on the other side. I'm just going to kind of stack them at an angle against the blue and white jar. And I just think that they are so beautifully perfect. Just gives it such a cozy look. I love all the coppers, metallics, blues, creams, whites. I just love it all. And on the very last shelf, we have some more of my favorite cookbooks, new and old. And I'm just going to go ahead and dress up my pear colored kitchen aid stand mixer. So I have this really beautiful tea towel. It's got pumpkins on there. I'm going to dress up my stand mixer by putting the towel inside of the bowl. Um, I'm hoping to paint this stand mixer white come springtime like a really glossy white I did get it in the pear color but I am looking forward to getting it in a really high gloss white to refinish it and I'm just gonna go ahead and put the towel in and just kind of finish that off just to give it a little bit of depth um, and then I'm just going to dress up the shelf a little bit more I have a Bath and Body Works I think it's like a blueberry maple pancakes uh, candle it's like a bluish purple which is perfect for the color scheme and it's got this copper top on it lid with uh, metallic pumpkins on there so I thought that was perfect so I can use the candle as decoration And I have one more of these metallic um, pumpkins that I got from Dollar Tree. So I'm kind of scattering through them throughout the built-in hutch. And I'm just going to use it on the other side just to kind of tie it all in and complete the look. If you guys are new to my channel, I'd love to get to know you. Let me know in the comment section, drop your name, introduce yourself, let me know where you're from. I wanna welcome you to the Bumblebee Farmhouse. I hope that you guys like this video and I hope that you'll subscribe and stay a while. Just a little bit about me. My name is Angie. Um, I created the Bumblebee Farmhouse as a wonderful and fun, safe environment and place just to have some fun and just to kind of go over my, some of my hobbies and my passions. As, as you can see, home decor. I love to shop. I like to cook, bake. You'll see that once in a while on my channel. I love beauty and fashion. So I like to incorporate all of that here into my channel. I've been married to my husband Danny for 18 years and you'll see him pop up on a video once in a while. I have two fur babies, Archie and Benny. They are just adorable um, little fluff balls. They're Pekingese. They're just so gorgeous. And um, I like to travel. I like a lot of things in life. I just like to enjoy life to its fullest. So I do try to add some of that onto my YouTube channel here. I am so grateful for all of you guys hanging out with me here today. Again, I hope you'll like and subscribe. Join my YouTube family. And I hope that you guys got a little bit of inspiration here at the Bumblebee Farmhouse to make your house a home sweet home. I want to thank you again for um, hanging out with me again today. And remember, friends, as Dorothy Gill once said, there's no place like home. That's right, sweet friends. Home, sweet home. I'll see you in the next one. Bye. And don't know if I told you, but I think you're the world. And I got this feeling you could be my girl. Come on.